Alexander Graham Bell, born in 1847, wasn't just the man who invented the telephone. He was a Scottish-born scientist, tinkerer, and champion of the deaf, driven by a passion for sound and communication. Born with a curious mind and a family steeped in linguistics, Bell's life was shaped by loss. Both his brothers succumbed to tuberculosis, while his mother was nearly deaf, fueling his desire to help overcome communication barriers. Though not a stellar student, Bell's brilliance shone outside the classroom. He invented a machine to dehusk wheat as a child and immersed himself in the mechanics of speech at his father's side. In 1871, he arrived in Boston, teaching elocution to the deaf and fascinated by the potential of electricity. His obsession with transmitting sound culminated in the iconic 1876 moment, Mr. Watson, come here. The telephone, though not the first attempt, revolutionized communication, forever linking voices across distances. But Bell's genius wasn't limited to telephones. He improved the phonograph, experimented with hydrofoils, and even contributed to the early development of aviation. Through it all, Bell remained dedicated to helping the deaf. He co-founded the American Association for the Deaf and financed schools for the hearing impaired. His life wasn't without controversy. Disputes over the telephone's patent and accusations of racism marred his later years. Yet, his inventions and pioneering spirit left an indelible mark on the world. When Bell passed away in 1922, he wasn't just remembered as the man who made telephones ring. He was the scientist who bridged the gap between sound and connection, leaving behind a legacy that continues to echo across generations.